Hello, and welcome back to While the Iron's Hot. This is a crafting puzzle adventure game, and last episode we carried out some more blacksmithing orders, making tools and whatnot for uh, various folk around the island here. Uh, we also just upgraded our forge uh, in the previous day, so uh, I imagine this is probably under construction. No, we can go inside. Ooh, okay, so now we've got a glowing blue flame. Very cool. Uh, let's see what happens when we add a few more to it. Let's try and get more in here. Nice. Okay. Um, well, that will allow us to... Um, make some magical items as well. Uh, we're going to be able to deliver the knitting needles we forged last episode as well. And we also want to go chat with the uh, rat thief uh, that we met. I think that was also last episode. Um, the rat who now is going to be taking up sewing. Uh, or maybe not. Was it sewing or knitting? It was knitting because of the knitting needles. Um, oh, and this tree's back. Let's harvest this wood. We might as well. I wonder if it's random every time. Hard to tell. Okay, this guy's face looks the same. Ah, young blacksmith. I knew it wouldn't be long before you returned as a customer sweater, as a for a custom sweater order, I, sh I should say. I was thinking we really lean into the blacksmith theme with maybe a hammer and an anvil. I'm sorry to interrupt, but I'm not here for a sweater. <laughs> However, I would like to ask for your help. Hmm, well I won't lie, that's disappointing. But I still like you. How can I help? I'm in need of a rare item. Everlasting candles. And not just one. I need enough for a chandelier. Are you joking? No? I've got a ton of those candles, but I doubt they'll be very useful considering they can't be lit. Why not? I've simply never been able to do it. I'm a rat who knits, not one who dabbles in magic. Haha, <laughs> don't be ridiculous. All I know is that the blacksmiths of old invented these candles, great ones like Tavastar. Some say they worked with fire so much the two became friends. And one day the forged fire spit out a little flame and gifted the smith the everlasting light. You seem smart, you'll figure it out. Plus, you've got a bigger fire than me. Here you go, next time don't come back unless it's about a sweater, alright? I'm kidding, but seriously. <laughs> Okay, cool, all right. Well, that's going to actually solve this um, chandelier order a lot faster than I thought it was going to. Well, that's uh, that's handy. Um, let's go back to our forge and get this thing crafted, I think. We might have to also talk to... Um, what's his name? Uh, just to get confirmation on this whole uh, dealio. Uh, how am I supposed to light those candles? Yeah, you'll need to find the eternal flame, but last I heard it's in... Yeah, we've done that already. It's in the old forge. Confident there could be a clue hidden in the rubble. Oh, maybe we don't have to... Um... Maybe we are just going to be able to craft this whole thing, because, um, what does our inventory look like? Those are blank. They're unlit. So I wonder if we put the four... Can we actually... Oh my gosh, we can! That's hilarious. Okay. Um... All right, and then we're gonna need, uh, I guess we should just look at the the chandelier thing. Okay, so it's for curved plates. Uh, oh, and now we can do that too. Was that, were we able to do that before? I don't think we were. Very cool. And was that for all four of them? Oh, dang. Okay, that's rad. Um, how do we make... Probably with strips. Yeah, that's the next question. 
Uh, that, no crafting. Chain. Eight. Oh, seven of the iron strips. Okay. Uh, let's do nine. That will go there. Fantastic. Okay, and that gives us nine, I believe. Uh, and now I think we can craft this. Well, we actually have to craft the chain first. Very cool. Okay, so now we'll put this in the center. These here. Nope, not that. Whoops. And then the candles in the corner. And there we have it. Excellent. We did it. I like how it shows six candles, even though we only crafted with four. Um, alrighty. Yeah, that, uh, that was done a lot quicker than I anticipated. So I guess now we can go back to the, um, what's it called, the Lumberjack Village, go talk to that guy. I wonder if we'll be, we'll be able to get access to that village soon. I don't know, might take a while. We still have to figure out how to free that ox. Oh, she has something. Here is your everlasting chandelier. Splendid. Yes, exquisite. Your reward will arrive and stall in a few days. Goodbye. That was one weird order. By the way, I have overheard Myrtle saying she'd like to talk to you. Well, you must have the ears of a bat. Haha. <laughs> I'm going to go now. Thanks for the tip. Well, maybe that's what that was all about then. Uh, Myrtle... Oh, Myrtle also wanted the knitting needles. So let's give her that first. Now let's talk to her again. Hello? Why can't, uh... Oh, we talked to her. Travel north to the Broken Bridge. Oh. <laughs> um. Okay. Interesting. Uh, we could technically pick up another couple orders if we wanted. We might as well, right? I mean, it makes sense to me, sort of. Kind of, sort of. But I don't know what will happen if we go to the broken bridge. Because the ox is still in the way. And I guess the dialogue kind of glitched out there. Unless we're able to don't have anything to cut your bindings with. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe this is an optional thing. Maybe we can just cut down the trees around the, uh, the ox. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, our durability is finally, um, coming through. Okay. So let's see what happens here. Ah, hello, sir. Hey, what are you doing here? Myrtle told me to install this equipment for you to make things more easily. Wasn't much fun dragging it here, I'll say. Thank you, that is really convenient. I'm go it's going to save me a lot of time. Indeed. I was also ordered to give you these, wood and ore that I gathered personally for this job. Awesome, I'll get the bridge fixed in no time. One more thing, I've been tinkering during my free time and I came up with designs for some tools. No one's been able to make much use of it, but as a blacksmith, maybe it'll serve you well. Thank you. To repair this bridge, all you need to do is fix the two holes. But watch your step, it's dangerous. Dang. Okay, so we got some... A couple more schematics. Screws and bolts. Okay, the screws and bolts might actually be very useful. And hinge. Did we not already have a schematic for those? Maybe we didn't. Interesting. Can be gifted to your ox. Also, I realize now that uh, <laughs> that's a bit of a spoiler, I guess, going forward. Um, we are going to have to figure that out. Okay, so we need three sets of nails, one chain, and some logs. Okay. Uh, sets of nails are 
are some strips. Uh, resources? Crafting. Sets of nails is three iron sharpened strips, so we need nine iron sharpened strips and then one chain, so a bunch. Nine and seven is 16. So we're gonna need, I think, that much. There we go. Okay, and then we're gonna have to sharpen all of these as well. Oh no. Okay, good, we can do it all. Thank the Lord. Oh, except actually, no, sorry. We don't want that, we want just nine, I think. I believe. Okay. Uh, so let's make the chain. Uh, oh, right. That's how we do that. There we go. Make that chain. And then the sharpened strips were just three across, okay. And now we can do that. Wonderful. Alrighty. I think we're good. Sweet. Ah, oh, man, we have to do more? Okay. Uh, so, three sets of screws and bolts, another chain, and two, no, four one by two plates. Uh, I've already forgotten. I think three sets of screws and bolts, which is, uh, two iron curve plates and one, uh, so we need six of those and three iron strips. So six iron curve plates. There we go. And nine more iron strips. I think. We'll just make more, I guess. Uh, and then, do we have to make any more? Uh, how does this work again? Like so. And one, two, three. Well, I guess that'll work. Okay, and then... Oh, we also need to do that, but we also need another chain anyway, so that's fine. I think it said... I mean, did it say... Did it say six of those one by two? I guess we can just go look. Four of those plates, okay. Four one by two plates. be it. And now we can cross the bridge. Fantastic. Also got another tree. Oh, we got quite a few trees. Oh, but that's it. Maybe that will come with time? Regardless, I think we'll, uh, let's just head back. Oh, Myrtle's here now. Great. Uh, no. I don't want to talk to you about this, though. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, man. Am I going to have to make this stuff first? This might be a problem. Uh, yeah. Hmm. I mean, technically, I could make the axe right now. Uh, let's do that. Sharpen it. 
I mean, I also technically could just give her uh, the one I had, but I want to kind of save that for me. Just give her this one. Hopefully we don't run into stamina problems. And hopefully this will also... Uh, Okay, so now can I talk to you about the bridge? No, I think it probably glitched out again. That is unfortunate. Okay, well I think we're just gonna have to go back to our place. Yep, that was a close call. Oh, and we got some mail too. You've got mail, return to your village and interact with your mailbox. Not before I go to sleep. Uh, yeah, until morning. Well, I think we did quite a bit of crafting. I just crafted 61, holy cow. Yeah, that was quite a few, my goodness. No buffs though, which is surprising. Alrighty, let's go see what kind of mail we've got going on. Uh, open our inventory, I guess. Letter from Opal. A trusted friend of mine has sent word of a rising blacksmith on Elian. Your skills have sparked my interest. Please come to my camp at the foot of Malima's snowy fields. There we can discuss more about your future on our land. Signed, Opal. Okay. Well, let's go do that, I guess. Maybe we can also uh, go chop down those few trees. Talk to Dryston. Oh, we want to talk to Dryston about this first. Okay. I don't know how the new recipes I got from that one guy will help me with the current stuff. Hey, Will, looks like you made a new friend. We should fix up the building to the right of the fort so that our new ox friend can have a place to rest. That's a good idea. Myrtle also said something about a gift that she had sent here. Ah, yeah, it's the cart that's right next to the house I just mentioned. I told Ash to leave it there. I also wanted to talk to you about a letter that I just received. It's from someone named Opal. Wow, Opal's al already taking an interest in you. My friend, he must see how good you are. What did he say in his letter? Not much. He wants me to go meet him in Malima. That's the miner's village, but usually no one has access to it besides them. To reach it, you'll have to go to their camp west of the Misty Valley. Here, just let me mark it on your map. Wow, that's pretty far. It is, but with your new ox and that gift from Myrtle, we can build you something that would make traveling easier. Some sort of a mobile forge, you know? Hmm, not really, but I'm intrigued to see. What do we need to build it? Ha, I'm a step ahead of you. I've already figured it all out, and I made a list on the design table in front of the house. My plan is to fix up the cart at the same time as we rebuild the stables for our ox. That's a good idea. Thank you, I'll go check it now. Okay, so... Oh, we're gonna be able to upgrade... Oh, I see. Yeah, we can't do that without stuff. So we need six things, six sets of nails, 12 sets of nails, one chain and two hinges. Oh, wow. Oh my god, there is a bunch of stuff we're gonna be able to upgrade. Okay. Dang. Um, 12 sets of nails and two hinges and a chain. Okay, let's figure this out. Uh, one chain is seven. I'm gonna bet on the fact that we already have some, um, some strips, iron strips. I don't know how to make the hinges. Uh, two one by one plates and one iron. So we need four one by ones and two sharpened strips, which I guess means we need more of these anyway. Okay, and then we need the one by one, which we need four of. stuff in 
then we need two of these to be sharpened, I think. Alright, so if we put those there. Whoops. Okay, so this will make the hinges. Wonderful. And then we're gonna need a chain. Was there other things we needed as well? Nails. We need nails. Forgot about the nails. Okay, so 12 things of nails, which is strips. And I think it's a one to one. So let's do this. There we go. And then we're going to have to sharpen them as well. Perfect. And I think it was just straight across, right? Uh, probably. I'm gonna find out the hard way. Okay, so that actually only made four, right? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, so we are gonna need quite a few. So we need to do that twice more, which means 24 more sets. Yeah, hot damn. Okay, well, it won't actually be that difficult. Um, 224. Yeah, not too bad. All right, and then we take these. Oh, whoops, wrong way. Wanted to do that instead. There we go. All right, let's get out of here. Fix the sales. So yeah, I guess that it's unfortunate that that uh, text thing glitched out with Myrtle. Um, I guess the ox is free then? She maybe set him free? And then we're also going to upgrade the... Oh, we don't have enough gold. Interesting. Okay. Uh, so that is... Yeah. So we're going to have to do another job, I guess. Oh, what does our uh, new house look like? Ooh, very fancy. Uh, what's in here? Can we just put random stuff in? Put a letter. Can do that. I don't really think we need the journal on us anymore. I don't know if we need the ring on us still. But that'll work. Okay. Yeah, so more gold is the thing. Um, okay, we do have another pickaxe order that we could fill. So maybe let's do that. Uh, so we're going to need some sharpened uh, one by two. There we go. And then we'll go here and sharpen these. What? Ah, man. I didn't mean to do that. Alrighty. Let me put this here. Nope, oh, that's not what I want. I am just all over the place. Alrighty. Let's go deliver that and then we'll hopefully be able to afford this. I don't think we were too far off. What is that um, castle in the background there? Yeah, there's the cart. Maybe we do still need to get the, the axe, or the ox rather, free. 
He's still there on the map, so... Uh, let's go in here. I don't know who... Oh, actually, also... Okay, it was him. I wonder if it's worth avoiding... Uh, giving these guys... Things. Or, like, giving the main, like, quest givers... Items back, you know? Hmm. Like, yeah, we could do him and him. I don't have a recipe for a hook yet, and that, I think, would require some, um, some, what's it called, uh, rope from the merchant. I wonder if it's actually closer to, uh, just go this way point begs the question um, let's actually just go do some adventure okay so now we can actually do this what does this do missing sharp item whoa oh my this is dangerous oh no uh, can I rest here Oh, this is in. This is dangerous. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, that is very treacherous. My goodness. Um, yeah, let's rest first. Oh my god, yeah, we are. We are in dire need of rest. My god. <laughs> Clouds lifted. Items crafted. Cool, we got the. Uh, another buff done. We're almost the next level, which is handy. Oh, whoa, we got... What's with our, um... Oh! Oh, what's the, uh... Energized? Interesting. Okay. That is actually very handy. We can also do this now, though. Cool. Across the swamp and travel northwest. Oh, okay, so maybe the... the what's it called? Is for the... Uh, swamp. Hey, Will, I forgot to tell you something important about your trip to go meet Opal. Before you reach the valley, you're going to have to go through a real nasty area. Oh, past the bridge I fixed for the lumberjacks? Yup, it's a really tricky place to travel, especially for someone who just arrived in Elian. Take care and remember, Elian has its secrets. Not all are friendly. Good idea. Thanks for the tip. Make sure you pay attention where you step in that swamp. Sometimes the ground can just swallow you. I've got a theory that it's haunted, but no one believes me. I'll pay attention. Thanks again. Yeah, we, uh, we learned that the hard way, didn't we? <laughs> um, we are actually kind of running out of time for this episode, so I don't know... Oh, what is all this about? Is this for, like, ingredients, maybe? Oh, and this is a... Oh, mobile for... Oh my god, there's a bunch of upgrades for this, too. Traveling gear scroll. Oh my god, lantern scroll. Compass. Holy cow, okay, this is, uh, this is pretty complex, my goodness. Okay, well, I guess there might not be, yeah, there's really not much point in, um, continuing on with this episode since we are so, um, close to being out of time. I want to keep it close to that 30-minute mark anyway. So, uh, yeah, I think that's where we'll leave it for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching, as always, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.